decisions. Mm. Um, the first one, I saw a, uh, a very drastic image of like a, a, a spiraling galaxy almost, um, in outer space. And what I saw was at the brightest, uh, part in the middle or in its center, um, was, it, it, it was almost, it reminded me of like a wheel, like the whole thing was like a wheel of some sort. Mm. And there were, I guess the right word would be spokes, were branching out from the center of this this galaxy, but it wasn't going all the way to the edges of the galaxy. It was just uh, remaining in the very center of the brightest part of this spiraling galaxy. And what I realized was that the, was that the shape of these four spokes that I saw um was branched out in a shape that looked just like a cross or the cross. Mm. Um, and so it was almost like this, this center where these four spokes were that were shaped like a cross was almost like a very power uh, that was causing this galaxy to spin mm. in the, the spiraling way that it did. Mm. Wow. Um, so that, that was the first vision I saw. Okay, before you launch the second one, uh, I want to comment on this one to share your understanding more. What do you think uh, relevant to you, relevant to God's work, or there are some uh, spiritual principles here? Feel free to expound before moving on. My, my uh, understanding, I think, is that the first more towards the the work that the Lord is doing on a more comprehensive scale. And then the second one, I, I think, was more uh, based towards my life. But uh, the first one that I just shared, um, I think, is, is significant uh, in the understanding or in the sense of uh, the work that the Lord is doing now, Lord, uh, within His people, Mm. Um, there's this, there's this sense of great, uh, I guess, get great control and of great power mm. um, that was exhibited the, in this. There's a in this order. Am I think about the stars will be yeah. governed by this movement, this this order. Am I that everything is put into place in circulation? Amen. By divine power, and we are just one of the stars. Am I causing? through with this whole movement am i making sense to you so yeah i think a feeding Amen. to to address your concern about you know what are going to happen to your life in general am i so god basically saying mm. your life is in my order you know so you're going to circulate me oh, yeah as i design it it's twelve twelve, by the way so yeah that's heavenly order basically. Amen. Mm. go ahead Next one. Um, the next one, I saw. I, I was having these combined images of, uh, like these working hands that were that were doing, that were working on something. It was very vague at first. Um, so uh, it seemed like the. I was just seeing these images of hands uh, or of a figure working uh, on land or on this. It was just very big. And just these, this impression of working and of working hands. Okay. And then it, it clarified into a, a whole vision where I saw, um, I saw myself uh, standing upon the porch with uh, what I assumed to be uh my future family yeah. and we were looking over uh, a wide ex uh, expanse of land that was in front of our house mm. i saw this wide and very very uh this very, very fruitful and abundant garden mm. laid out in front of us yeah. uh, that was directly in front of our house oh, wow. um, and beyond that was this this very beautiful scenery um of this country in which we were living yeah 
directly in front of this house was this was this beautiful and very assorted and abundant and fruitful garden that oh. I think that we as a family had worked on. Oh wow. Um well there you go. It was very it was very beautiful image. Yeah. <laughs> I think that was that's what he wanted, right? <laughs> so I'm teasing you. So. <laughs> yeah. Well rapid eye in prayer, I think that's where simple stuff so straightforward. So rapid eye in prayer, so yeah. Bless the Lord. Mm. Well Lord it is uh Truly, my greatest desire, Lord, to see your will be done or accomplished, Lord, not only in my life, Lord, but within uh, the expanse of your people, Lord, and of your purpose. Lord, I, I can even feel it growing in me day by day, Lord, the, the desire, Lord, the enjoyment, Lord, to see your purpose fulfilled, Lord, and manifested, Lord, within your people. Lord, as my as my life, Lord, takes a transition, Lord, from uh, young pursuits, Lord, and the the aspirations of a young mind, mm. Lord, as or to one that seeks to see, Lord, your your plans fulfilled, Lord, beyond the scope of my own life, Lord, but to see a fruition take place in the lives around me, mm. Lord, within the body of Christ itself. Mm. And Lord, truly these are things that um, uh, in, in our hearts, Lord, together, Lord, as one people, Lord, to see fulfilled, Lord, in our midst, mm. Lord, within your people. Mm. So Lord, I pray that this, this same desire, Lord, and this same pursuit would continue to grow, Lord, and burn within my own heart, mm. Lord, within the, the hearts of my family, Mm-hmm. Lord, and of those around me and of your people. Mm. So, Lord, I pray, Lord, that this very pursuit and this very desire would mm. shape, Lord, every part of us, mm. Lord, every aspect of our souls and our minds. Mm. So, Lord, I pray, Lord, in this way that you would bless, <laughs> that you bless me, Lord, my yeah. family, and yeah. our people, Lord, and your people. Yes. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' holy Amen. name. Glory to God. Bless the Lord. Hey man, well, it's always a joy to spend time with you, Noah, and bring my best to everybody. Okay, so yeah, you must be hungry, so eat something. I'm teasing you. (laughs) Okay, bless you, okay? Okay, 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 bye then. Uh Yeah, thank you. Okay, bye. Uh